Okay, and now that I have shown you how to use the app, how to do the transactions, how to get your USDN to USDT and all, I would like to show you the settings of the app. Okay, what we have to do is go to mine. Okay, and then at the top right here we have the uh, setting button. We click it. And then as you can see we have the language uh, switching, we have the currency, price display, and we have the version of the app and the logout button. Let's uh, explore these together. So we go for the language, we have English, French, Spanish, Portuguese and few other languages. After you select your language, you just save it. And then we have the uh, currency price display. You can choose any currency that you would like to display in your app. Okay, you have Australian dollar, uh, British pound, USD. So we selected USD here and then we go back. And as you can see here, we can view the version of the uh, app that we're using. Okay, it's the first uh, version. And then the last one is the logout button. Okay, so now I would like to show you a few other options. As you can see here, you have my team. You have to key in your transaction password. Just, okay. And then you can view your team here. And then you have the invite uh, to join. You can invite people to join. As you can see on the top right, you, have, you can send this whole poster and invite people through that. And then at the bottom, on the right side, you have the copy, where you can copy your invitation link and send it to people. And at the left side down here, you have the QR code, where people can scan and join through that. And then you have my income, where you can calculate your income. You have your dynamic, your community, and then your global. If you are a global leader, you can view all your, your income here your daily income and then you have the security center you have your mobile phone number the one you registered with right here and then you can modify your mailbox and then you can set the transaction password here as well and modify the login password and you can also strengthen your your security and safety by the uh, by adding the face detect and also the google verification and those are a few uh, more options in the settings. Okay, and now we have a few other options here. As you can see, if you click on the receiving address, it, it can't open now, but it will soon be updated by our team. So I'll show you how to do a feedback. As you can see here, if there is any dysfunction or any problem with the app, you can, you can write it down here and then just uh, submit it to us. Or if you have any suggestion, anything that you'd like to suggest, for example, voice uh, recognition or anything, you can just uh, suggest here. And you have feedback as well, and then just uh, click on submission. And we have the help center here. Okay, the help center basically uh, explains everything uh, in writing. It's all written here, all the things that I have uh, explained in the video. You can scroll all the way down and, and, and read them. And we also have the smart uh, customer service. It's not there yet, but it will soon be updated by our team. And at the bottom here, we have About Us, where you can also find us on social media, our website, and more things, more information about NGK.